Out with Betty so if you're new to this channel you are very much welcome to stay and if you're returning thank you so much for your continued support so um, as we're still in the month of love I just wanted to share with you another breakfast idea that you can also share with your friends family or even better halves during this month of love so today we are going to be making potato cheese balls okay if you don't know how to do this or if you always wanted to try something new this is the time so stay tuned and watch this video to the end and you can let me know what you think and if you like this video you can always go ahead and give me that thumbs up okay so let's get started we're going to start by boiling our potatoes i'm just going to add in some water then some salt to taste then I'm just going to close it and leave it to boil for about 10 to 15 minutes. For our potato cheese bowl, we're going to need some cheese, some breadcrumbs, salt to taste, eggs, milk, and all-purpose flour. I'm going to go ahead and prepare our mixture as our potatoes are boiling. As you can see, this mixture we're going to need eggs, some salt, then we're going to add some all-purpose flour, I'm also going to add in some milk, just a little bit, to make our mixture a bit thick. So I'm looking to achieve a thick consistency. I'm just gonna go ahead and add a bit of flour. what we are going for and our mixture is ready I'm going to go ahead and put this in the fridge as we check on our potatoes So it's been 15 minutes and I think our potatoes are ready. So we are going to go ahead and mash them up. Add in some flour and continue mashing. I'm using all purpose flour. I'm 
Our mixture is ready. So I'm going to go ahead and take some portion from our mixture and form it into a ball like that. Then I'm going to add our cheese that I've already cut into small portions like that and then form into a ball like that. Then I'm going to place it there. I'm gonna do the same for another one. Like that. Put our cheese in, then we cover it up. We mold it into a ball. Like that. So once you have your breadcrumbs, what you're going to do is you're going to take our potato cheese balls and dip it in the solution that we made earlier on and then also dip it in the breadcrumbs to cover it up. So So now we are going to go ahead and take our potato cheese balls and dip it in our solution that we made like that then you want to go ahead and dip it in your breadcrumbs so that it is well coated like that Then you go and place it on the side. Then we're going to do that the same for another one. Make sure it's well coated. You can always go ahead and add more breadcrumbs if you run out. Just make sure you have enough to work with. There we go. So once you're all done with your cheese balls, with the number of cheese balls that you want to coat, then you're going to go ahead and fry them. You can turn them around so that all sides are well cooked. And our cheese balls, as you can see, they are ready.
so guys our potato cheese balls are ready and i cannot wait to dig in look at that look at that golden brown color on the top so you can always go ahead and add in your sauce whichever sauce you have i'm gonna use some hot chunky sauce because i just like some hotness to my meals and yeah let me go ahead and try it for you guys so that next time you can also make one for yourselves Amazing guys, amazing. Look at that. Ooh. Mm. Guys, this is amazing, okay? Mm. Guys, go and try this recipe and let me know what your thoughts are after you've tried it because mm, mm -mm amazing amazing so that's it for this video guys if you did like this potato cheese ball recipe then do not forget to give me a like comment and if you haven't subscribed please do subscribe to support me till next time don't forget to wear your mask wash your hands and social distance stay blessed bye